Hello, and welcome back to another video of HSC. So, I hope you guys are doing well in this project. Currently, in this video, we are on our last part and foremost, our fourth part of the series titled Bluetooth Controlled Cars Using Arduino. So, if you got any questions, please leave them in the comments below and I'll answer them as much as possible. By the way, this may be my last video for me, and after that, the series is all done. But, I have a few modifications that I have implemented into, into my code as well as the model itself. You know, by the way, I forgot to tell you, I forgot to put a clip of my car moving with my Bluetooth RC controller from my previous video, which was part 3. But hopefully, I get to show you this clip in this video, or part 4 of the series. So let's get started, and I'll first mention all of my modifications into this project. The first one is that all of the four wires from each side were not placed through each hole of the chassis properly. So pretty much caused a bit of a first-hand issue. I'm just fast forwarding this step by a lot because this step seems unnecessary in this video. I forgot to mention the caution in my previous video that you want to make sure you remove that jumper before you plug in your port to the Arduino Uno from your computer. And once you have already done that, then you can now move on to Uploading the code. Oh, also, by the way, I got my entire code here. And hopefully you don't experience any errors on behalf of the code uploading process. Like, this is done uploading in the bottom left. And now you can unplug the port from the Uno. And finally, you can attach that jumper back onto the motor shield. And finally, on the last step, just like what you did last time, attach that black wire into the right side. And here's the red light flashing on this HC05 module. Alright, so let's take our phones and go to the app. And then you want to press the settings button. In the options menu, press connect to car. Before you connect to that Bluetooth device, make sure to press scan for nearby devices. But if you see the HC05 right over there, click it. And you can now move the car by pressing one of these arrows inside this controller. Oh well, the car successfully moved. Let's go! Fortunate enough, you can adjust the speed from the top right. And here you might notice that the car speed went up by a bit. And also, you can experiment it out by playing with the controls and having fun with it.